Hello everybody, welcome to the Scientist Room. Today we are taking a look at a brand new app from Audio Thing. I always love it when Audio Thing port their desktop stuff to iOS. Right, so this is the SR88 memory rhythm based on a, a, a really old analog drum machine. Very simple, very easy to use. Sounds great if you're into this kind of thing. So kind of like this, you know, let's set this going. Now you can have it stop and start here or you can have it stop and start with the host of course in this case it's AUM because we're just looking at the drum machine randomize select from different patches we have some effects here Now, so it's pretty easy. You just kind of program your sounds in here. So global reverb, global drive, compressor, master gain, self explanatory stuff. Right, okay. You've got some different patterns. So you choose your drum kit and then you can choose your pattern here or random, choose a random pattern. Okay, other cool things we can do, of course, we have our, stop that, stop it near the host. You have 32 steps. You can, you know, have polyrhythmic steps sort of thing so you could just have nine that kind of that kind of thing all the way down to two one all the way up to 32 okay so that's quite obvious you can program this by tapping on the squares here so we'll just put some new stuff in you could just go well, let's have some sort of four on the floor thing going on with the kick you get the idea right so now draw in your high hats You can clear a lane and then like this, so super simples. Make some adjustments to the sound. Let's speed this up a little bit, shall we, for fun? Cool beans. You've got tempo here, so let's go quicker. You can, if you click this little button here, the one that looks like a play button in reverse, this will randomize the pan every time it loops. So you can get constantly varying patterns. Hi hat two here, it's too loud, so. Brilliant. And by controlling the decay and pitch times of hi-hat one and two, you can get like open and closed effects going on. Like I said, we could randomize the snare as well. Every time it comes round. 
Very simple stuff. Let's see if we've got parameters exposed. Yes, we have. And also the effect, so you could modulate those. You can get some really nice. Gnarly sounds, you know. Okay. What else? Simple. Well, we have a randomize as well. You can also choose to, when you randomize, lock parameters up. So let's hit our lock button and say, let's. Let's lock up all the effects so they don't randomize and let's lock the decays so they don't randomize. Come out of here and then when we press play, again, let's just do it with this. When we randomize now, the locked ones won't. And then we can either go in here and take off one at a time or we can go in here and go unlock all parameters and you're back to normal. Right, now, patterns. Let's stop this. Once you've got a pattern you like and you want to save it right, tap on this and then go and make a folder wherever you like, whether it's in Dropbox or where have you, I'm going to go down and find the folder I made earlier. And I think I called it, what do I call it? Oh, there we go. SR88 MIDI. Select that folder. You'll see I've got one pattern in there. And just hit save. And uh, yeah, I'll just keep both because they're both different patterns. And then what you can do is go into another DAW or open a sequencer or something Go to your files app. You can like, you know, open it from the side and then just drag that MIDI in to your door or wherever you like and have any drum machine player. It's MIDI, you know, or any whatever you want. Or, of course, you can have the SR88 player. And that, guys, is basically that. It's that easy. So what we're going to do is I'll take Maxima off and I'm going to put Punch Lab in and we're going to have a mess around. So let's start this thing off, shall we? Let's See. I'll start it with this. So put it through things like punch. I've got a limiter on here as well, just in cases. I'm gonna go and mess around with the pattern because I've got some mad. Uh, Stereo's panning going on here. I'm randomizing to set up a half decent sound. Let's let Punch Lab deal with all the kind of gnarliness. Cool. <laughs> right, okay. So let's sort this out. Have the hi hat randomize each pass. Put a symbol in here and there. Okay, let's have a mess around with Punch Lab. Let's have a look at some of the patches, shall we? Just for fun. Close the microphone for this bit.
great fun, you can go nuts. So you need some sort of boost on it. Of course you've got your master gain. There you go. I think it's four ninety nine at the moment. So uh, yeah, go and get it while you can. Anyway, there you go. Uh, the audio thing SR eighty eight memory rhythm, uh, and it's a port from the well, it's an exact like an exact port from the desktop. Very cool. I love stuff like this because it's super retro and it's a it's a great vibe and it looks great as well. It looks really nice. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, consider becoming a patron, and I will see you guys later. Ta-ra!